Now let me discuss what is the classifications of a plants. Plants are classified as a non-flowering and also flowering plants. Now take a look at the flow charts of the types of plants. Non-flowering plant consists of ferns, moss, and conifers. Meanwhile, flowering plants consist of monocotyledons and dicotyledons. Now, let me discuss about the characteristic of non-flowering plants. Non-flowering plants do not produce flowers and also do not produce fruits. Fern reproduce through the spores. Meanwhile, the conifers will reproduce by the seed inside the cones. The transport system in ferns and conifers is called vascular. Meanwhile, the moses is called non-vascular. Vascular plants have vascular cells. It has true roots, stem, and leaf. The function is to transport water and food. Meanwhile, non-vascular plants is very simple and small without the presence of vascular systems. Here are the summaries for the moses, ferns, and the conifers. Flowering plants is a plant that produces flowers, which will become fruits that contain seeds. We are going to discuss the parts of seed, which is called cotyledon. There are two types of cotyledon, which is the first one is monocotyledon, consists of one cotyledon, and second one is dicotyledon, consists of two cotyledons. The function is to store food during germination. Here are the differences between monocotyledons and dicotyledons in root, which is monocot have fibrous and dicot have tap root. In stem, monocot have a non woody stem, meanwhile, for dicotyledon have woody stem. For leaf, monocotyledon have parallel vein, meanwhile, dicotyledon have network like vein. Next, we are going to discuss about dichotomous key. Dichotomous key is used by the biologists to identify and classify systematically based on the similarities and differences. It is consists of series of couplets which have two statements describing the characteristics of the organism. How to read the dichotomous key? Always look at the object and start from the top. Read both statements and decide which one is the best fit to the object and follow the instruction. Let's say for number 2 and it is scaly skin and go to number 4. Next one, at the number 4, when you are come to the name of your object, so you are done. Let's try by yourself to identify the dichotomous key of the plant. So with that, thank you very much and have a nice day. See you again.